Welcome to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, where we will explore more deeply about all things magical in a magical world that is truly amazing, with me the bittersweet channel, without further ado, let's get started now. The Patronus Charm, introduced in Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, is a defensive spell which produces a silver, animal guardian, used to protect a witch or wizard against dementors. Each Patronus takes the form of a different animal that has a special affinity with the caster, there are many forms that your Patronus could take, it could be a familiar animal or, in rarer cases, a magical creature. The Patronus Charm, with Spells Expecto Patronum was the most famous and one of the most powerful defensive charms known to Wizardkind. It was an immensely complicated and extremely difficult spell. To successfully cast the spell, one began by mustering the happiest memory they could think of, the happier the memory, the better the charm would work. Alternatively, one could imagine a scenario that would make for a very happy memory. The next step was to begin drawing circles with their wands so as to increase the power of their spell. They must then say the incantation, Expecto Patronum, the Patronus would come from the tip of the wand and could be directed towards a target. The Patronus charm was widely regarded as advanced magic, far beyond any WT level, in 1994 Remus Lupin stated that the charm was, in fact ridiculously advanced. This charm was, indeed, so perilous, that few wizards slash witches could conjure up. It was a general belief held by the wizarding world that only those who were pure of heart were able to cast Patronuses. It's rare for a dark wizard to successfully conjure a Patronus. For this reason, Lord Voldemort and his Death Eaters were not able. What are the most popular Patronuses belonging to Wizarding World fans? What are the rarest? Which ones do we secretly wish we had? We've done our research, so we wanted to share the results, as well as explore what your Patronus might say about you. 5 Favorites from the Top 10 Most Popular, Dolphin It's a good thing that dolphins are the most common Patronus form, because they're friendly sociable mammals. They live in pods, communicate in squeaks, whistles and clicks and are incredible playful creatures. If you have a dolphin as a Patronus, perhaps it matches your own extroverted personality? The next is, Tonkinese Cat. There are no fewer than six types of cat in the top 20, but the one that came in second to the dolphin was the Tonkinese Cat. It's no real surprise that cats were amongst the most common Patronus types. According to J.K. Rowling, it is usual for a Patronus to take the form of an animal commonly found in the caster's native country. A Tonkinese cat Patronus might indicate that you're a curious and loving person. The next animal of the favorite top 5 Patronus charms animal is, Fox. Following the felines, the fox slinks into fifth place. Foxes are cunning, resourceful and fiercely intelligent, remind you of anything? That's right. We wouldn't be surprised if some members of Slytherin House find themselves with a fox Patronus. If deep down you're channeling the fox, you'll likely have resilience in spades. Saint Bernard the sixth most popular Patronus is a type of dog. Like cats, there are quite a few friendly canines in the top 20, but the St. Bernard comes out top dog. A gentle giant, the St. Bernard reminds us a little of Rubius Hagrid in nature. Last of the top 5 is, Hedgehog. This prickly customer just makes it into the top 5. Hedgehogs hibernate in cold climates, so if your Patronus takes this form it might be that you'd rather curl up under a blanket than take on the winter chill. Personality-wise, 
These critters may look cute but they've got a hard edge when it comes to defending themselves. Perhaps you have hidden depths to your personality if this is your Patronus. Those are the top 5 Patronus charm animals based on the research we got from the data on the Wizarding World website Pottermore. So, what is your Patronus animal? Visit the Wizarding World Pottermore to find out on www.wizardingworld.com. That's it for our video this time, see you next time, still about many other interesting information in Wizarding World Harry Potter. We the Bittersweet Channel team say goodbye to you witch and wizardings, have a nice day. Mischief managed. Knox.